Hi, this is Professor CC19, and today we're playing level 196 on our quest to the end of Candy Crush Saga, where we have 20 moves to collect one hazelnut and one cherry. Now this board looks very simple, very straightforward. We have ingredients on the top of the board that we need to bring down to the bottom. We have some licorice locks that are blocking them from coming down all the way. We also have some wrapped candies and marmalade to help us clear out the licorice and bring them down. We have six colors on the board, so um, that could make it hard for us to make specials and um, bring the ingredients down quickly. But you'd think that would be all just looking at this board. It's not. Because watch what happens when I make a move. I'm going to actually make the most of that move by undoing the um, marmalade there. So when I make a move, we have some licorice swirls coming down from the top. But um, they're not really normal. Well, the licorice swirls are perfectly normal, but the amount of them that we get is abnormal. Because any move I make that we don't take out at least one licorice, we get a lot more. So unless I'm doing something that will considerably help me in bringing the ingredients down, like setting off one of these, or um, making a vertical striped candy that can bring it down quickly, I'm going to try and um, remove the licorice. So unless my moves have a definite purpose, I'm going to try and remove as much licorice as possible. Here, though, I think that as long as I just scoop this up, I can bring both my ingredients down. So that's how we beat level 196. It's pretty tough to do if you're not aware that the licorice will take over the board. But really, try and bring your ingredients down before the licorice takes over. Um, if you're on the new platform, you can keep exiting and re-entering without losing lives until your ingredients are either right near each other on the board, which is best positioning, or you have a set method of bringing them both down quickly. Because once the licorice um, comes down, it's hard to deal with a lot of it. So strategy, like I said, try and get those ingredients close together and make sure that your moves have a purpose and bring them down quickly. If you found this video helpful to you, please subscribe. If you're struggling with this level, I think that a coconut wheel might help you on this level. But really, um, you're going to have to rely on the very first coconut wheel that you get and how well it can bring the ingredients down to the bottom of the board. So um, a coconut wheel won't really help if it's not positioned right, but it could give you a boost in beating the level if it is. If you found this video helpful to you, please subscribe. If you're stuck on any level of the game, please leave a comment below. I'll try and help you. And as always, thanks for watching.